it was clear that Black Station was occupied by fascists. But Ullman had said he'd wait for me there. I had to risk it. Who is it? Surrender and you won't get hurt. I swear! What's up guys, I'm Padre here and we are back with some more Metro and this is the Black Station mission and I'm gonna go for the perfect stealth in this one, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. <laughs> what took you so long? Hey, where's Pavel? Did he... Alright, later. The situation got worse. Nazis literally flooded the station. He'll have to act alone, sorry. But if you can shut down their generator, it'll be easier to sneak past the guards. Take this. Nice. I will wait for you in the deserted tunnel, the polis. Okay, so... I played this mission for a little bit. I wanted to, you know, find the generator and whatnot. And I found the first node and <laughs> I picked it up. I'm gonna show it to you right now. Right here, it's, it has two page, pages, and I'm gonna show show it to you how uh, how to grab it if you want to, you know. Also, I want the moral point for this conversation. Uh huh. And who is gonna feed your children, huh? Sturbenfuhrer, perhaps? What the life? Maybe get the families and go to Ganza. You know what happened to those who tried. Bastards. Okay, so the note is right, right here. Now just wait for this guy to turn, uh, you know, to get up. And he will walk in that direction. So he's not a problem. And you can grab the note without any problems. And we have one more guard in here. Oh, come on. And I'm not gonna touch him, I'm just gonna follow him. Okay, do I want to take out that light? I don't need to, but... Oh, fuck it, I'm gonna take it out. Just in case. How's the generator working? Okay, as long as no one touches oh. That was close. Put a guard down. Doha, Kozoi, come here. Watch the generator. And if I catch you playing cards, you're dead, man. Nice. More moral points. <laughs> I killed a lot of Nazis in, in the previous mission, so, you know, I'm balancing it out with these conversations, which, which is pretty cool. I would like to get the, the good ending, but, you know, I'm not going to try hard. Okay. Do not touch those cans. Nice. Oh, nice. That guy. Oh, move. So I'm gonna take off, uh, take out the light in here. And now I need to disable the generator. Now, I can't see. Is that someone right there? No. Okay, I was just waiting for this guy, he's gonna stand there for a little bit and then move. Now I can turn off the light and disable the generator without touching anyone. Hey. Just like that. Nice. 
so let's see. Oh fuck, he's he's coming in here. Okay, no, so now I need to wait for him to move. He's gonna stand there for uh, for a few seconds and turn around. Oh fuck that shit. Oh nice. That was close. Didn't know about that. Last time I just stood there, you know. <laughs> and now I need him to do his rounds and turn around again. I'm gonna wait in here. Let's hope I don't fail this. Because this might be pretty easy to fail. I need while he's turning around, I need to hide in here. And then move to the right. So Let's see if I can get this done. Yeah, nice. So, let's see. Yeah, this way, this way. I remember this way. And then I pretty much stopped playing. There's a few minutes more and I played. No, 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 no. Good thing it was a throwing knife. I need to change my button for for throwables because this is not the first time I do this. Okay, so this is the only tricky part in this mission. So I need to pay attention to what I do. Nice. So, as you can hear, there's one guy right above me. And one guy on the left. I need them both to be turned, you know, to give me their backs. To turn around so I can, so I can move. Let's see if it works. I guess he turned around. Yeah, nice. And I pretty much stopped playing here. This is the exact spot where I stopped playing. And I hope this is the right way to go, because if not, you know... <laughs> it might be... Might be bad. Let's see, what do we have on this side? Yeah. I don't feel like going there. I can hear shit, man. What the fuck? Can I open these? I can hear stuff right there. Again! <sighs> okay, I can't open anything. I need the key. Okay, mask. Okay, 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 I can calm down. This has, yeah, has the key. Okay, give me the key. I, will, I guess that was a lurker. These fucking Nazis can't even, you know, kill everything before they make their base. Oh, nice. So there's one more key somewhere. And eh, fuck it. <laughs> I don't feel like risking my run for some loot. Well, <laughs> I will do that. You already know that I will do that, but I don't know. Not right now. You still fuck that shit. Oh, nice. Filters, those are always welcome. Do I need to jump here? Nope. I guess I don't need the mask anymore. <sighs> so I will come and say, 
Hey, who's there? And the gate to Metro 2 was shut down forever. Those living here forgot about Metro 2. Who is this dreads? But only the pneumonia is Metro 2. It does exist. It is all around us. Its tunnels entwined with our own. Its stations behind the walls of our stations. The two metro and those who believe that the shepherds could not abandon their herd say that they watch over us still. Directing our every step, but do not show themselves to us. And that is what faith in the invisible watchers is. But why they do not wish people to know about them? First of all, sheep are sinful, for they turn down their shepherds in the time of weakness. And ever since we have been separated from our world, the shepherds have evolved in a different way. They are no longer human, creatures of a higher order. Logic it is not understandable for us. They have the power to change everything, even to return the lost beautiful world of us. But because we will build against them, they do not take part in our destiny anymore. However, they exist everywhere and are all knowing and all seeing. Only after we repent our sins will they reveal themselves and offer their help. And salvation will come. By the people who believe in the invisible watchers. Interesting legend. Okay, <laughs> I'm sorry for the long silence, but I really wanted to know what what he's talking about, and it, it's really, really, really interesting. Would they really want me to jump down there? I guess so. Okay, I'm gonna give you the mask. Just, just calm down. And this is creepy. Is that the trap or something? Yeah, I guess it is. Nice. Pretty smooth so far, I have to say. I don't like that though. <laughs> Thank you. Can I interact with this? Oh yeah, nice. I don't know what, what does that thing do, but it's okay. <laughs> oh, you know, it's nice. I can't grab it. Nice. Oh, this is the second note. Nice. So we have all the notes so far. In what? Five hours or four hours of gameplay? We got all of them? It's great. And this, this music, it's creepy. <laughs> Sounds like music from 
X-Files or some shit like that. <laughs> Can't grab anything. Please don't attack me or don't do stuff I wouldn't like to happen. Is that Dulman? Yeah, it is. Yeah. <laughs> I heard you're climbing here and rest. Yeah, give me a second. First, I need to explore this place. So yeah, I got the perfect stealth, and I can't grab anything from here. Oh, what a shame. Yeah, perfect stealth. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I, I hope you guys enjoyed, and thank you for watching. See you next time. We'll reach Polis soon. These are not the usual mutant creatures. This is something else. Something much worse. Fear. We're weak. We'll die. This is the end. Even children, even children hated by their parents, try to love and understand them. We wish, to we wish to understand you and help and help you. Wicked phenomenon, yes. But you know, it's not any more evil than say fire. It all depends on your point of view. Try to get a better understanding of things before you make your judgment. Let's move out now. It's not safe here. <laughs>